hope all of you are well. I am Edgar Carcamo. I am from Honduras. I am 18 years old. I am in the project Leonard Cesar Seven Rivers. It's, it's a charitable house, which means they help people with disabilities. I think it plays a very important role in the society because through the charity and the help, it provides the proof the quality everyone deserves it, not only for what you can do or what you cannot do. Uh, they are superhumans, they can do anything. This is one of those places where you realize everyone is worth the same. Nobody is more than anyone. Right now I am in my room, it's a small one, but I'm not the one who cares about having many things or many space in his room and just I'm not like that I just need my bed and the TV which by the way has helped me with my English and that flag who motivates me every day I wake up that flag is the first thing I, be, I see and the important is I feel comfortable where I am As you can see I am in the in the room where the activities take place but I can't I couldn't record a video about our daily routines because I need a permission which I haven't got so I can tell you what we do every day every week on Mondays well before to start to explain I have to say every morning are the same Crossword, card games, dominoes, chess, something like that. And sometimes, like today, for, for today, we play badminton, baseball, I lost ball, bowling, something like that. Today we play outside. So every morning is the same. Now the afternoon on Mondays. One lady is coming, one volunteer for a Scrabble game. On Tuesday, another volunteer is coming for play the piano, so we have a music session. On Wednesday, if the weather is nice, we go to the lake for fishing. If not nice, we have to find out the way how to work. On Thursday, and my favorite, we have film afternoon. And Friday, we have bingo. That's, that's it what we do every day, every week. One of the most important things I decided to come to the UK was to learn English, which has improved and much. I am going to tell you how I knew about ICYE. My paternal aunt, Swani Karkamo, volunteered in France in 1998, the, years, the year I was born. That volunteer made her grow as a person. And then she said, if that helped me, why not to my nephew? And then one day, when I was just 12, she, she told me, I want you to go as a volunteer abroad when you turn 18. She asked me, where do you want to go? Taiwan or England? I have no idea what was Taiwan, to be, to be honest, at that age. With all hesitation, I said England. And then she didn't show me any list. ICYE has a list which has many countries to choose. However, if I will have taught a list, I will always have chosen England. Because the second thing, the second thing, it's tough. Football. I really love football. I think in England it's the uh, best football league in the world. The third thing, my dream was to be in London. Really love London. Really like go there the weekends. Um, she told me six years ago because my dad has to be prepared then I am here, I am enjoying myself, I am learning about the British culture. By the way, I have met amazing people, many friends from everywhere.
before I came, I said, you have to enjoy everything, even if it's insignificant. Sometimes the activity managers plan trips, so I must say, I really enjoy when we go outside with some of the residents, and that's what I like about my project. The challenge that I have had since I arrived, and more when I arrived, has been and continues to be to understand the residents in the aspect of the language because each resident has their disability and that made each one has a way of speaking that was almost impossible to me to understand. And, but now my English has improved and I can understand most of them. Undoubtedly, this is one of the best sparing life. Being a volunteer will make you grow as a person makes the difference, be the change you want to see in the world, come to the UK with ICYE, you will know the culture, you will learn the language, and it's not necessary to mention it, but you will meet people from all over the world. And I must say, this pairing has changed me, my way to be, in the aspect to be independent, and because back home I have never made something for me, and being here, um, everything I do, it's by myself, to myself, and I hope this pairing also changed me, my way to be as a person, and I hope and I have to.